And power is simply how fast you're doing the work. The more power you have, the faster you can get the job done. We can cover way more territory in uh, two hours than we could online. And it's also the confidence, you know, the fact that they know that they're doing it right. You know, when you do examples, I'll get them to do a few questions and then they, they begin to build up their confidence because they know, yes, I'm understanding this and yes, I can do this. After I created this thing, I was trying to think of a fun name for it. And uh, I came up with a math mobile and it was going to be uh, similar to the Batmobile. And I was going to be the, the math man. Da -da 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 math man. So teaching high school. Uh, Engagement always helps when you can add a little fun to your lessons. So that's what I was up. A lot of my students actually live out in the country. So if I want to get into their driveways, I need to make it portable. So I thought I need to mount this on the back of my truck. So I talked to uh, my principal, Mrs. Clausen, a wonderful lady, and she gave me a few ideas and gave me a green light. And then I phoned up my dad. Uh, he and I love to do projects in, uh, in the shop together. So I told them, here's my idea. I want to mount a whiteboard on the back of my truck and travel around teaching math. They stay small. Uh, like my, first, my smallest one is calculus, where there will be just one student. And the most I've had was six or seven students. I won't, uh, you know, we have to respect social distancing. So I had set up traffic cones, uh, you know, establishing boundaries so everybody didn't get too close. Um, but, you know, we stay below the 10 uh, number and uh, to my surprise most of the students the girls in fact pull up with uh, their half tons and they all backed up to my uh, to my smart board and they put their lawn chairs in the back of their truck and and that's how we do math so uh, only in Saskatchewan I guess. The other bonus that I hadn't anticipated uh, was the social aspect the students were really missing the classroom atmosphere with being with friends and, and joking around with their teacher and so forth. So that's been a huge bonus that wasn't a part of the initial planning. We use some apps to connect with them online and I provide virtual lessons. I, uh, I make videos of myself teaching uh, exactly the same lesson that I would do outdoors. I, uh, I come back into my office and I sit in front of my computer and I've got a headset with a microphone and uh, a tablet and I can I can reproduce exactly the same lesson that I did outside uh, as a video in my in my office so I post that online so they have access to it there as well turn out to be I don't I don't feel like I'm worthy of, of, of this attention for coming up for some uh, coming up with something new uh, you know outdoor education is not a new concept it just seemed to blend into my needs and uh, grabbed a few old ideas and come up with some new ideas and and that was the birth of the math mobile.